हैं आमने सामने चर्चा करते हैं। आ जाइए डिबेट हो जाए मैं तैयार हूँ आ जाए मैदान headlines today special it is the dominant issue of our national discourse at the moment the land ordinance bill has pitted the congress versus the bjp upa versus nda farmer versus industry and the big question is who has the better legislation and what does the country really need does it need what the upa has had promised or what the nda is promising who has the better legislation when it comes to the land bill and is the bill in the interest of the country that's the big question we want to pose a few weeks ago nitin gadkari union minister posed a challenge to the congress he was ready to take them on in a public debate and we are delighted today that digvijay singh of the congress has accepted his challenge please welcome and give a big hand to nitin gadkari of the nda digvijay singh of the upa and the congress party In this debate, we have farmers, Kisan bhi hai. Ham unse bhi sab, unke bhi sawal lenge. We have people from urban India, middle class India. We will take their questions as well. But the first question, before I come to the specifics of the land debate, for the first time on television, we will go into the specifics of this big debate. The basic question: Is this bill in the national interest or not? Why is the NDA, Mr. Gadkari, being projected by the Congress as anti-farmer, and why Mr. Digvijay Singh is your previous government being projected as anti-growth? Nitin Gadkari, you start first and tell us why do you believe that this bill is not anti-farmer? Why is it in the national interest? Why are you staking so much on this bill? First of all, this bill is passed in the Parliament with unanimous resolution. there is no opposition from anybody so first of all it is in the national interest it is in the farmer interest it is in the poor interest it is in the public interest and it is in the social interest if I, it is passed unanimously by just just rajdev just 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 just, 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 to, just to give me chance to yes, clear my position ahead. first of all i want to clear the thing that any cost we are only making five amendments in this bill and there's five amendments are related with only the security and the defense the uh, the rural electrification and rural infrastructure then uh, industrial corridor and low cost housing we don't want to acquire any land for the big industry for the corporate for the big personality nothing neither for private engineering college private medical college private universities basically for the public interest for the poor interest for the farmer interest and for the national interest and the for the social interest only these five amendments are there and now so when rahul in, gandhi says adani ambani ke liye ye bill banaya this is for adani you you believe they are misleading the country i am going to ask you the question what is the thing here which is going to support these amendments are support to the big corporate of this country can you tell me a single incident if it is uh, not there why you are making allegation against our government we don't want to support adani ambani and anybody suitcase suit boot we are very clear that it is only interest of the poor and the farmers we will not acquire a 1 feet of land for the adani ambani corporate and rich people it is only we have to make this amendment only for the poor people i am telling you there is public private me. partnerships that you are going to do who is it going to be for where this is in the amendment there is no there is, there will be no acquisition of land for public private partnerships of government owned land that is what i have with me yes i want to tell you this is the bill 105 act which is passed by the parliament in the upa regime this is the 105 i just read it if you want to it they exempted sia and consent clause from this 13 acts it includes the coal act and you know that in the coal scandal the cag already clear it it is a scandal of 1 lakh 88000 crores supreme court cancel the things and now after only auction of 20 mines government get 2 lakh crores i am asking the congress party a question <laughs> at that time when you acquired the land for the coal mine why you are not choosing the way of consent clause and si when you give the land to wadra ji in haryana 
lot of land acquired by the Hudda ji in, uh, near Haryana and at that time why you are not taking the advantage of consent clause and SIA at a time when we are talking about the rural infrastructure particularly of irrigation where 80 percent of land is acquired only for irrigation in Maharashtra 16.8 percent in Jharkhand 5.6 percent and how it is it is in the interest of the farmer at that time you are taking this all this objection and creating an anti-farmer stand it is not appropriate okay I will come to the specifics that you have raised but Digvijay Singh you accuse them of being suit boot ki sarkar what is wrong first of all if they decide if there is a corporate which is willing to tie up with the government so long as the farmer gets his compensation you are anti-growth if they are you are projecting them as anti-farmer because you want the poor farmer to remain poor you don't want the poor farmer of this country to, Rajib, uh, to enrich may, himself may I, please you, go ahead will you please allow me as much time as you allowed mr natin gatkari number Your one, time number starts one now. because because in the earlier debate i was the, the, I was not given enough Achal. time. Okay. Provided Mr. Nitin Gadkari has the patience. 100%. One second. What I'm trying to say is, I'm extremely happy when he said and praised the two th th 2013 <coughs> act which we brought, which was passed unanimously. He said, we are all very happy. We unanimously passed it. Thank you very much. Then, what was the need for the ordinance? Number two. Number three. He has made certain allegations. He has said they created an aura, a wrong disinformation, that there was no provision for national security and defense. Please go to 2013 section 2. I will read A. For strategic purposes relating to naval, military, air force, armed forces, union, including central parallel forces and other vital national security or defense of India, state, safety of the people. This provision is already there in 2013. They have not amended that. Come, coming to that. Consent so, one, one you second, are not second. answering my question. I am coming to that. I am coming to that. Nitin hey, Gadkari, you are not, Nitin Gadkari has asked a question. Rajdi, you must respond to Rajdi, what he said. First, first, let me explain. The disinformation campaign consent run by clause, Mr. Nitin Gadkari. One, one, one second. Not. Sir, one minute. One let second. Let me explain. They had said we had to make an ordinance because in the 2013 there was no provision for the acquisition for military, navy, no, air force. No, one second. One, let, me hey, let, let me finish. Let him finish, sir. Let him finish. I will come back to you. So there was no consent clause in that. There is provision. No, no, sir, no, no, you have not no, answered. You are, you are misleading. Sir, you have not answered his question. I am coming. He is saying your Haryana government I'm coming. gives away land freely. No, one second. One second. One, that time it you is wrong. It is, it is wrong. It is wrong. Not one inch of land was given by the Haryana government to Mr. Robert Wadra. Not one inch. One inch. Sir, Robert Wadra, one, one second. No, he but said, other industry one is second. This is, this is, Robert Mr. 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 Rajdi Sardesai. Mr. Rajdi Sardesai. I have got the record of the Lakwishana. Like you just see it. I will give you. One second. Rajdi, he Rajdi. Is, let, he's saying, he's saying, he's saying area released for land acquisition by Haryana government between 2005 and 14. Yes. Department of Urban yes. Estates, 109,028.54 acres. Department of Industry, 83, 81.10. Total land release, 19,309.64. One, one, one second, one second. There are two different issues. Mm -hmm. One is the land acquisition to be given to A, B, C. Mm -hmm. And changing the land use. There are two different things. The acquisition by Mr. Nathan Gadkari that the Haryana state government allotted land to, to Mr. Robert Wadra is wrong. Number two, we are very happy if the present government discussed the ordinance. If there were any lacuna, they should have discussed this through the select committee with all political parties. No, no allow me this yes. time. Rajiv, don't be unf unfair to okay, me. Okay, I'm not being unfair. Please, don't, don't interrupt me. You didn't interrupt him. You don't interrupt me also. What I'm trying to say is that he praised the 2013 act. But if there were any lacuna, there may have been, they should have consulted the, the political parties and referred the issue to the select committee of the Lok Sabha. Even today, even today, if the prime minister refers this issue, land acquisition bill to a select committee where the select committee can discuss with all political parties and the Kisan organizations, or Kisan farmers organizations, we are prepared to discuss. But 
and there is no there is no limitation hey, of how time. many years sir are we going to discuss mr rajdeep please listen rajdeep sir. you are not being unfair you are being unfair let me finish yes let me finish the time schedule can be maintained you called us anti growth we registered the highest growth in the country ever since the independence in spite of the fact that there was a worldwide recession our growth was much Mr. higher Singhji, than the average india can i come to the NDA. specific clauses i want you to respond see I'm, I'm, sir you have raised an important point let me finish rajdeep let me finish what i am trying to say is that you say that the, he says that we have only amended we have brought in five these things to to bring in the issue of national security that the, it is not there in these five what i am trying to say is sir, sir can i now tell our viewers let them understand the consent clause upa versus nda let's understand which is the better bill this debate is about which is the better bill it is not between UPA, congress and it? bjp it is between the um, between the farmers and the state okay so let us let us discuss okay. not on the bjp congress okay issues. upa 2013 upa 2013 required 80% of land owners in acquisitions for private and 70% for public private partnership exactly. this is what the upa said exactly. 80% of land owners consent is required and consent is the key word in acquisition for private and 70% for public private partnership Correct. project nda said it will not be required for national security defense <laughs> rural infrastructure industrial corridors and public private infrastructure projects First so you all. have made five exceptions therefore if today i want to acquire land if the government wants to acquire land for public private infrastructure project my land will go agar if you in noida you want to set up a slum redevelopment project you will not take the consent of any of the people who are owning the land here you will acquire it that is the question which has to be raised first of all he is absolutely correct that land acquisition act is there but in 2013 act the land acquisition clause is there but it need 80% consent for defense and for the no, no, defense no, no, purposes no, no, no it is there the consent clause no, no, and no. si is there no sir it no, is not there sir, it's sir not you there. it sir, is not, not there. there they had made an exception for defense and national security no sir yes, sir you sir, are sir, you are denying that 100% sir yes, you are saying there, wrong. there yes, was no yes, exception absolutely sir, wrong sir that's why si was there no consent was not there si was required for all 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 land but no consent was not there yeah but si was there ah, and that yes. would have delayed project well, he first, was leading then first of, first of all for the defense purpose if you want to construct a airport near srinagar mm -hmm. for for the security of this country is concerned yes. at that time if the consent clause and si is there if the people not giving the permission you cannot construct the airport for the security of this country so that's why we are making that amendment this is the ordinance and we only exempted these five things from this si clause and consent clause this is the this is the ordinance now i am telling you a logical a logical and a constitutional point mm -hmm. the last date for this uh, bill was 31st december mm -hmm. and if you fail to make the ordinance it means that there will be no effect of any ordinance on the on the state on the country on the farmer so it it is in the interest of the farmer it was in the interest of the farmer to make the ordinance without that we cannot give one is to two or one is to four land acquisition cost because the that already Sir, there is i want to you are saying consent was uh, do you believe that the consent clause that the congress was bringing in would mean it would be impossible to develop land in this country that is what you are saying that consent clause is the way the congress has positioned it First of would have all, made it difficult for anyone to uh, to acquire land that's your point 100% but right? I mean, I but your your point on the other hand mr digvijay singh ji yes. let us assume ki i want to build a dam yes or i want to build a highway yes the manner in which the congress has framed the act it will be impossible No, even if no, three no. people opposed it no 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 even no. if three people opposed no, it Rajdeep. you cannot no, build the no, land no rajdeep please please see the 2013 it will never happen one, one no second. highway no road no, no highway no road what what one second no no he no yeah, let okay, him not interrupt ahead. please don't interrupt please see the 2013 clause of emergency clause of section 9 mm -hmm. and so section 40 <coughs> there is an emergency clause in the original bill where social impact assessment is also exempted for national security issues on natural calamity issues no, no, there's already there in the please please see sir please can we read. talk about consent one second consent is not necessary in in land acquisition of the nas on defense please see section 2 please see please see please see section 2 i would take I you to i am asking you sir yes. 
in your Congress in the UPA bill, yes, you said 80 percent of land only for in acquisition for private only and 70 percent for public private. Exactly. And not not the for government projects. In not in for government projects. Industry is saying that with this kind of law, it would be impossible to develop a project. Four people can get together out of ten and say, "Hamko ye project acha nahi hai. Project will be cancelled." But Nitin Gadkari ji has just now assured the people through your uh, yes. debate that they will not acquire an in inch of land for any industry. He has just now said. Now I am coming to that. He has just now promised to the nation huh. that not one inch of land will be acquired for Ambani's and Adani's. But what I am trying to say is that the consent clause and this, the clause is only specific, as you rightly pointed out, for PPAs and uh, private companies. But as for the in emergency uh, cases, there is a clause 9 and clause 40. Please see where neither social impact assessment nor the compensation has to be given. Please tell me, Nitin Gadkari, who will this land be acquired for? Who will this land be acquired for? What will this land be acquired for? If this is such a major clause, First of all, if you believe Narendra Modi is saying this act as the UPA passed it will lead to de-industrialization yes. of India. So please tell me who is going to acquire the land so under your new law? It's a very important question which is ethically, legally and constitutionally you are absolutely correct. The land acquisition is a subject in the concurrent list. Yes. There are certain subjects where central government is authorized to make the law. Mm -hmm. There are certain subjects state government is supposed to make the law. Mm -hmm. And there are some subjects where state and central both they are capable to make the law. Mm -hmm. Now the land acquisition law, the act is passed by the parliament. After that, Huddaji government makes the rules for it. That is their right. Prithviraj Chavan makes the different type of rules in Maharashtra. So there is a provision. Even if the state government don't want to accept the law, the pass, the sub, uh, some pro, uh, clause passed by the central government. They can change it, and that's why there so was a compensation problem. Now I'm telling yes. you, just I'm giving the answer of your question. Now the problem is that the land is acquired by the collector. Mm -hmm. The collector, as far as revenue act is concerned, collector is working under the state government. And now the problem is that it is the act which is passed by the parliament. It is the basically for some facts. But as for the rules are concerned, Jailalitaji's government make the different rules, Huddaji make different rules, and Puthiraj Chavan make different rules. Yes. And they are right as far as constitution is concerned because of the concurrently they are right. Yes. Now the problem is that, just I am telling you the question. First of all, we do not want to acquire any, law, any land for corporate, mm -hmm. the rich people. Ambani and Adani, very common words they are using it, and for the rich people. So who are you going to acquire it for? So who are who are the one minute? Don't who are you going to acquire this land for? Then, what is then it going I am to be asking, for? Then I am telling you what public interest, social interest, poor interest. Give me an example. Yes, I am giving you the example. What, what will you acquire this land the rural, for? Rural rural infrastructure means means the road for the village connectivity. The rural infrastructure means the transformer in the village. The rural infrastructure means the public government school and government hospital in the village. The rural infrastructure means irrigation. And 80% of the land in the country is acquired by irrigation. From starting from Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru to up to Indira Gandhi, at every time the land acquired, majority land is acquired for irrigation. Now the simple so question. So what is the problem then? What so is you just the understand? Then I, you, Singhi, what is the problem then? You, if you, you say today, answer. if Nitin Gadkari is giving you an assurance that this land will be acquired only for public purposes, yes. effectively that is what he is saying. Then what is your problem? The problem is in the section 10A in the ordinance. Okay. Now, please read section 10A, D and E. Mm. Huh? Industrial corridors set up by the appropriate government and is undertaking in which the land shall be acquired up to one kilometer on both sides. If there is a corrid corridor of one of 10,000 kilometers on both sides, if you see 20,000 square kilometers will be acquired which amounts to 2 crore hectares. What will this land be allotted to? Who will be, who will be getting this land, if not corporates? So you are saying that the land along the industrial corridor will go to corporates. That is your suspicion that uh, Mr. Nitin Gadkari will say he is building a highway there. Along the highway only the corporates will get the land. No, that is what you are saying. This is, this is the apprehension. That is your as apprehension. A, as my friend rightly pointed out, if, there is, if he is not giving to any corporate, put it in the ordinance, put it in the bill. 
Nitin Gadkari, he he wants you to put in the bill. No land will be given to corporate. No. Already. Now come on, now, now you know no, nobody is going to put this in a law. Digvijay Singh ji, you are making a mess. You are making a mess. How can you say ये, that? This is a statement that he is when he is saying that not an inch of land will be acquired for corporates. ये मजाक नहीं बना रहे। अब मैं आपको, yes. I want to clear it. One thing is very clear that industrial corridor is there. Yes. What is the meaning of industrial corridor? It is just like like a industrial area. From one kilometer to two hundred kilometer, every feet there is a industry. That is not the meaning. Mm -hmm. There are a cluster of industries. Fifty kilometers land will be open, but when there is a village, there will be one cluster. From one kilometer side that the road, and there will be industry. Now you understand. I am from Nagpur. Mm -hmm. In Vidarbha, we are making cotton. If suppose the industrial corridor between Mumbai and Nagpur, mm -hmm. if whatever the cotton we are we are we are available there, that can be used for making cloth, ready-made garments, and export. So I am telling you, suppose we need pre-cooling plant, cold storage, storage system. The farmers can construct all this storage tank, everything on his land. And suppose anywhere, if he want to start any agro-processing industry, he also can draw you know, material. You know, Vikram Singh it. ji, 67. We did a survey two years ago. 67. percent of farmers children said they don't want to be on agriculture they want to move towards other uh, industry you need rural jobs rural infrastructure aapne to bhoot khada kar liya hai ki ye log corporate mein chale jayenge ek tarah se you have created this ghost you have created a ghost that this government will only sell what is wrong if there is industrialization taking place in the country what is wrong if land Certainly as long not. as farmer gets compensation key question is फार्मर मस्ट गेट कॉम्पनसेशन अगर मुझे मेरी जमीन बेचनी है मुझे उसके लिए कॉम्पनसेशन मिलना चाहिए फोर टाइम्स द प्राइस बस वही सवाल है विल यू प्लीज विल यू प्लीज पर एक वन थिंग राजदेव जी आई जस्ट वांट टू आस्क यू 5 मिनट्स विदाउट दिस इंटरप्शन देखो जैसे कि आई विल गिव यू 2 मिनट्स विदाउट दिस इंटरप्शन नो 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 यू शुड नॉट इंटरप्ट दैट या ही वांट इंटरप्ट सो आई एम आई एम रिप्रोस दिस आई वांट यू टू टेल यू आई एम रिस्पोंडिंग आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू ऑन द बोर्ड एंड आई एम रिस्पोंडिंग फर्स्ट कॉम्पनसेशन नो नो आई एम रिस्पोंडिंग टू यू फर्स्ट यस यू सी फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ of independent india the concept of land acquisition and rehabilitation resettlement has been brought under one umbrella mm -hmm. that is came at the initiative of mrs sonia gandhi mr rahul gandhi in the upa government okay otherwise resettlement re and rehabilitation was not a part of the act i am coming to that we are not against growth we are not against industrialization but we only want that such land which is not productive should be left for industrialization and that is why we had brought uh, so multi crop irrigated land cannot be acquired should not be should not should, be when when but if is, i want to sell my land and i get six times the value why can i not there is no there is the no power, power should be with the farmer so kisan ke hath mein taakat honi chahiye this is what i'm this is what i'm saying sarkar broker kyun ban rahi hai this is what i'm saying that if there is a consent clause and there is an agreement between the farmer and the uh, and the land developer the government does not come in 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 fact, in Madhya Pradesh, the Indra Sagar Dam on Mad Narmada had the largest displacement in the country today, and it went out without an agitation. And even Mr. Narendra Kumar Chauhan, the present Madhya Pradesh BJP president, he was a, then a member of Parliament when I was the Chief Minister. He said, "If you give this compensation, I will touch your feet publicly." I gave, and he touched my feet publicly. You know, it is at the end of the day, Nitin Gadkari. Ah, take a minute. Take a minute. अगर किसान है और आई एम देर एनी बॉडी हु ओन्स लैंड वी आर नॉट चाइना जमीन जो है सरकार के पास नहीं है चाइना में जमीन सरकार के पास होती है इन इंडिया लैंड इज विद प्राइवेट इंडिविजुअल आई हैव द राइट टू डिसाइड वॉट आई वॉन्ट टू डू विद हंड्रेड परसेंट राइट करेक्ट एंड यू हैव टू गिव मी द प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ प्रोवाइडिंग मी फोर टाइम्स कॉम्पनसेशन एज पर योर एक्ट शो द कॉम्पनसेशन ऑन आर बोर्ड आर कॉम्पनसेशन विल शो यू दैट बोथ द एक्ट से फोर टाइम्स इन रूरल इंडिया एंड टू टाइम्स इन अर्बन इंडिया राइट we want compensation should that not only be the debate you have to ensure that if i am giving my land i am giving it of my own free will you cannot decide how much uh, uh, whether i should give uh, give up my land or not meri consent aapko chahiye aur aap mujhe chaut tarfa four times the value of the land you will give me that should be the debate already it is there
Well, but then, what, then, I, then why I, are we having this I, debate? I, it is a political are, debate. May I? Because some party and leader want to prove that Narendra Modi is against former. May I? Narendra Modi and NDA government is against poor. Narendra Modi is a government of corporate. Narendra Modi is a government of rich people, and they want to make the politics for that. So, yeah, that is the only business for them. Politics shall be a Congress. One hundred percent. May I? 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 It is not only a question. एक मिनट, एक मिनट. हाँ. It is not only a question. It is not only a question of farmers. Yes. There are families who are rural artisans. Yes. Rural landless. Yes. That is why the social impact assessment is necessary, which they have done away with. Sir, if you do a social impact, sir, just a minute. If you do a social impact assessment of every project. It will take years for the project. Six months. Is this the limitation? Never, of never it happened in six, six months. months. Six years. Six it years. Never there happens. was never, never, never a provision. No, no. Let's be there very. There was never a provision. Sir, let us be very. How are you saying six years? Sir, let us be very clear. There are parts of this country where projects have been stalled for eight years, ten years because of agitations. But not because of social impact assessment. No, no. There you was are no bring, there. It you was are not there. Social impact assessment will take six years. No, six months. There is in the in the act itself. Are you convinced it will take six months? It it, it is provided in the, the act. Court. It I is provided the in the court act. Court. There is a limitation for six months. I will go to the court protesting against it. Yes. I will go to the court protesting against it. The right right of the farmer to the court cannot be taken away. Okay, I am going to take audience question, but Please before that, I want to ask both of you one question. You are both talking of compensation. Fact is and it, rehabilitation is a limit. Sir, both. हरियाणा में आपकी सरकार थी कांग्रेस गवर्नमेंट यू डिड नॉट गिव फोर टाइम्स द वैल्यू ऑफ द लैंड टू द फार्मर महाराष्ट्र में देर इज अ बीजेपी गवर्नमेंट यू आर नॉट गिविंग द फार्मर फोर फोर टाइम यू आर गिविंग टू पॉइंट टू परसेंट इन हरियाणा and in some case in maharashtra you have given two uh, two I times to, the land i just rectify no, that is the truth no 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 i am telling you when this act was passed yes at that time there was a government of congress party actually prithviraj chavan who mm. makes the rule yes the government they given it one is to two yes but after this act yes. we have taken a decision i personally phone to haryana chief minister manohar lal ji and i just give him that you must clear it immediately and you must take the cabinet meeting immediately and rectify the mistake of hudda government and they taken a decision that in rural area it is 1 is to 4 and urban area it is 1 is to 2 the devendra fadnavis government has also taken that decision and i am as a minister of national highway where my land acquisition cost was 70000 crores now rajdeep i am paying 180000 crores and i i already sign a file on which i am giving compensation in rural area it one is to four and in urban area one is to two and now under the leadership of pradhan mantri narendra modi in we have taken a decision the up to up to word was there in his, in that we drop that word and now we are making the new law in the parliament and with this amendment that the up to word will no there you have to give the land acquisition cost one is to four into rural area and one is to two into urban area no compromise on this my, issue my only that worry, is the my very only, clear request sir i agree with compensation and i think both sides agree my worry only is consent is the nda government preventing the far, preventing the farmer from having his say over his property you want to take over the land of the farmer because you want to fast track projects is the allegation and as a process i have no right what is my bargaining power i just government give, of india and a big uh, I, I, I just uh, give, give public example. sector I, I, versus I, an ordinary farmer I, where is the battle i just give you the example this is a lake this is a dam of mm -hmm. 3000 acre i am by the canal system the water is going to 3 lakh acres mm -hmm. now the land of 3000 acre If the ATP, it will be there will be no irrigation, no road, there will be no railway, <laughs> there will be no metro. What is going to happen in this country? Digvijay Singh ji, Digvijay Singh ji, I am surprised. Huh? I am surprised by either innocence or ignorance of Mr. Nit Nitin Gadkari. Uh. The fact remains, there is no consent. Eighty percent consent. No consent needed, no consent consent needed in government projects. Only in PPP and private projects. I think I think he's 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 misled. Either he's ignorant or innocent about no, the act. No, you are making the politics. You know the thing. All the things are on the record. I am where constantly the, appealing the to the act? Congress party. Where is it in the act? The act show has it not act. at all. Show it. Show it. I am showing it here. Here, the yes, the, con that. the consent clause. The consent clause is only for listen. 
ownership of the land continues to west with the government, government. government. that will be an exception and exceptions provided that no land shall be transferred by way of acquisition in contravention of any law relating to land transfer. Basically, they are saying that they have put five exceptions. You are claiming that these five exceptions will be misused and thereby they no, will take away land that from is the farmer. I am saying in the original clause, yes. in the original clause, there is no consent provision for irrigation projects. This is what I am saying. There is no consent required for government projects. This is what I am saying. Where the consent is clause is you only see? in section 2, subsection 2. Please see that. Please read it out. Public-private partnership projects, the prior consent of at least 70% of those affected there you are. will be leaded. Not Pub government. Not government. Not government. Public, pri 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 public private. If Nitin Gadkari has a company and you tie up with a private person to set up an irrigation project, will you take the permission or not? And this is what they have first, amended. First of all, this is what they have yes, amended. It is totally irrelevant. Yes. First of all, the today everything is that act which is passed by 213, 2013 mm -hmm. in the parliament. Mm -hmm. Why we are making the exemption for five? five yes. Why? Why are you doing the five yeah, exemption? That's the problem. Is that because of irrigation? Because of rural infrastructure, because there. of affordable housing, because of rural electrification, because of industrial corridor. I accept it. It yes. is there. And industrial corridor is for the poor people. So you should say openly. Openly we are saying. Say I am saying open industrialization. We need, what is wrong? What is wrong if Ambani and Adani acquire? One minute. What is wrong if Ambani and Adani acquire it, land for industrialization? How you can say? Or, why how, don't you say it? How you can say, Rajdeep, that anybody, the industrial corridor Ambani is going to acquire? Anybody? Why what not? You have? I am you saying. Can say why are like you this? against industry? Why are you all both against? Why are you against industry? What is wrong if they acquire it? What is wrong? Actually. The land you must the provide the farmer compensation. That's yes. all. Not only farmer, the landless labor, the, the rural artisan, they have to be rehabilitated, resettled. That is also important. So and that, that is why social minute. impact assessment is necessary. Eight minute. Please uh, ask the farmers now. Okay, Chaniya. Kisano se puchte hai. Aye. Aye. Aap, eight minute. Aap, aap samship me bade. आप बताइए जमीन किसान की है आ, और किसान से सहमति नहीं ले रहे कॉरिडोर रोड बनाइए लेकिन बाकी जो एक एक किलोमीटर अधिग्रहण करने की बात कर रहे हैं वो कतई नहीं होनी चाहिए किसान की मर्जी से अधिग्रहण होना चाहिए उसमें किसान अपना तो कोई आ, नहीं आप मुझे बताइए सरकार कह रही है कि अगर कोई प्रोजेक्ट हो आ, जो सरकार आपके हित में है जैसे हाउसिंग का प्रोजेक्ट हो कह रही है दस में से कंसेंट आठ लोगों का अगर मिल जाए तो प्रोजेक्ट चलेगा आप कह रहे हैं दस में से दस लोगों का लेना पड़ेगा देखिए सभी का मेजोरिटी का लेना पड़ेगा मेजोरिटी का नहीं अस्सी परसेंट का तो उसमें सहमति होनी चाहिए लेकिन रोड के लिए जो सार्वजनिक हित की बात है उसके लिए किसान तैयार है लेकिन उसके इधर उधर एक एक किलोमीटर जो जमीन अधिग्रहण की बात है उस पर किसान अच्छा ये बताइए अच्छा ये ऑब्जेक्शन अच्छा ये बताइए एक मिनट आपने अच्छी बात रखी वन किलोमीटर I am telling Gadkari you, ji, sir. the fear that the farmers have is in the name of saying that you are going to acquire the land for industrial corridors. What you will do is one kilometer of either side of the corridor, you will give away the land for cheap to someone and the farmer will be forced to give away his land without taking his consent. So if I live near the Mumbai-Pune highway or if I live near a major uh, uh, the, the, the Delhi, uh, the Delhi Mumbai corridor, I will have to give up my land without my consent. That is what the farmers I'm are objecting. Exactly. I'm giving them. I'm giving them. Our Delhi Agra Highway. First of all, on the industrial corridor, one kilometer away, there is no industry in line. There are some villages. The same thing no, again. No, just, just listen me. You are repeating the hey, same thing again. Hey, 
प्रक्रिया करने वाली इंडस्ट्री आएगी को स्टोरेज आएगा प्रीकूलिंग प्लांट आएगा स्टोरेज सिस्टम आएगी और वो गाँव का किसान है खुद का यह सब काम वहां कर सकता है और उस माल पर प्रोसेसिंग होगा वहां पैकिंग होगा वहां को स्टोरेज में रखा जाए आलू होगा तो को स्टोरेज में रखा जाएगा क्या यह किसान के विरोध में और दूसरी बात क्या किसान के सब लड़के दिल्ली और मुंबई आए किसान के सब लड़के दिल्ली और मुंबई आए उनके गांव में उनको रोजगार मिलता है तो कोई गलत है एक मिनट एक मिनट एक मिनट एक मिनट एक मिनट आप एक मिनट एक मिनट एक मिनट सर एक दूसरी नहीं नहीं वन मिनट आप कहा से है ग्रेटर नोएडा में अच्छा ग्रेटर नोएडा आप मुझे बताइए सरकार कह रही एक मिनट सर अब सुनिए अब सुनाई अब सुनना पड़ेगा आप मुझे बताइए कि अगर सरकार कह रही है कि जब लैंड अक्वायर करेगी आपको चौतरफा फोर टाइम्स कॉम्पनसेशन यू विल गेट फोर टाइम्स कॉम्पनसेशन आपकी जमीन के लिए जो आपकी वैल्यू है जो आप समझते हैं आपकी जमीन की वैल्यू है आपको चौतरफा और आपको नौकरी भी मिलेगी अगर इंडस्ट्रियल कॉरिडोर वहां बन रहा है राइट वन एम्प्लॉयमेंट विल ऑल्सो भी प्रोवाइडेड टू मेंबर ऑफ फैमिली एक परिवार में एक नौकरी एक, एक परिवार में एक नौकरी इससे आपको क्या ऑब्जेक्शन है मेरी पूरी बात सुनिएगा राजदीप जी आ, आप अपनी बात संक्षिप्त में रखिए ये बड़ा ये देश, आप बताइए ना ये देश को गुमराह कर रहे हैं हमारा कोई मुद्दा किसानों का चार गुना मुआवजे का नहीं है विषय है लाइवलीहुड जीवन यापन वो जमीन जिससे हमारे गांवों का कहा जिंदगी हम उससे गुजारा करते आ रहे हैं हमारी सारी पुस्ते उससे गुजारा कर रही हैं और उस खेती से उस गांव के पचास परिवार जो खेती हर मजदूर कहलाते हैं बढ़ाई हैं लोहार है भीमर है ये परिवार में एक आदमी को नौकरी दे रहे हैं उन लोगों का क्या होगा जो 200 परिवार गांवों में अपना खेती पर जीवन यापन करते हैं अच्छा ठीक है ये ये गांव के किसान को और खेती हर मजदूर को स्वरोजगार नहीं मानते ये इंडस्ट्री का आप आप मुझे बताइए आप ये ये मैं पूरी बात बताऊंगा नहीं नहीं आप मुझे बताइए क्या आप ये सही नहीं है कि किसान भी चाहता है की नौकरिया मिले की उनके बच्चे जो है उनको कहीं अगर गाँव में इंडस्ट्रियलाइजेशन हो आप नहीं चाहते की गाँव में कोई इंडस्ट्रियलाइज विकास के खिलाफ नहीं है हम विकास के बिल्कुल खिलाफ नहीं है लेकिन जिस तरीके से हमारे जो ग्रामीण जीवन है उसको तहस नहस किया जा रहा है देखिए मुआवजा हमें थोड़ा सा दे नहीं दिया नहीं। उससे ताजिंदगी हमारा पूरा नहीं पड़ेगा जमीन हमारा एक डिपॉजिट है जमीन सावधी जमा उससे हमारी सारी पुस्तें आने वाली अच्छा खाती है आपने अपनी बात रखी है आपने अपनी बात रखी क्या दे से दट समेयर डाउन द लाइन दिस इज द फियर इरीगेशन प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज द प्रॉब्लम दैट द फार्मर इज फेसिंग टू विच यू सीम टू हैव बीन फेल यू हैव फेल टू कम्युनिकेट एंड एक्सप्लेन टू हिम हाउ डू यू रिस्पॉन्ड देखो पहली बात तो ऐसी है जी कि एक परिवार को नौकरी मिलेगी पर उस गांव में अगर उद्योग होगा तो वहां के बाकी भी लड़कों को उसमें काम मिलेगा राइट right. जहां एक बड़ी इंडस्ट्री आती है तो वहां की इकोनॉमी बदल जाती है दूसरी बात Now you can do it in English. You can tell us in English. Now the problem is that yes, if we want to increase the industrial growth rate, agriculture growth rate, we need capital investment. And if we need capital investment, without that we cannot increase employment potential. Now the problem is that that agriculture growth rate in Madhya Pradesh is 23%. Mm -hmm. In Gujarat it is 14%. Mm -hmm. And the country average is 4%. It is because of that we need more irrigation. and well, out of 70% of water is going to sea now we have to stop that water to to control the system by which we can use that water for the irrigation where agriculture so production will increase by two and half times you are saying acquisition is critical for our growth rural growth rural growth rural jobs will also be created only through land acquisition 
that's what you're saying you will need to have an architecture wherein a kisan can that where, not wherein all. a farmer that can is, give his land to you not and get criteria. compensation there are a lot of other thing also uh, we have to make the appropriate policy Rajib. yes we have to make the land available and we have to use the raw material of the agriculture to the same to that industry okay if if suppose the wheat is there Dik you Vijay have to make the biscuit factory there Dik otherwise Vijay. the wheat cannot get Dik correct Singh, Dik Vijay Singh, you have to answer one question yes you seem to want to keep the kisan living on his land no. as a small and marginal farmer for no, no. if no no the, the, now you have to also listen to us sir yes please go the ahead. way the la, the way you had framed the land acquisition law yes you <laughs> wanted to protect the farmer in terms of compensation which was good yes you said that consent is important in certain instances which was good because you were recognizing the uh, the ownership of a, a of a private land owner but the question will be that somewhere you will have to also recognize that a country needs to progress through major projects infrastructure projects are the way forward they will provide more jobs the congress is not offering any alternative to that the why? congress as this lady was clapping aapko lagta hai ye what you want to raise that with mr digvijay singh what do you want to say uh, sir ek baat puchna chahti hu you can say it in english all yeah bolo hindi bolo 125 mukh khane ke liye hain padhe likhon ka ek bahut bada varg hai टेक्नोक्रेट भी हैं, किसान का बच्चा भी है मजदूर का बच्चा है पहले वो विदेशों में कमाने के लिए चले जाते थे पूरे मिडिल ईस्ट में आग लगी हुई है यूरोप में आ, मंदी है हाँ मेरा सवाल ये है कि वो बच्चे कहाँ जाएं, उन्हें रोजगार चाहिए यहाँ पर बिजनेस चाहिए निवेश चाहिए आप लड़ रहे हैं आप you know, एक मिनट दिग्विजय सिंह जी दिग्विजय सिंह जी रिस्पॉन्ड टू दैट एक मिनट एक मिनट दिग्विजय सिंह जी रिस्पॉन्ड एक एक मिनट एक मिनट सर दिग्विजय सिंह जी एक मिनट एक मिनट सर सर एक मिनट एक मिनट दिग्विजय सिंह जी दिस इज बिकमिंग अ बैटल एक मिनट ये एक लड़ाई बन रही है एक मिनट सर एक लड़ाई बन रही है एक तरफ इंडस्ट्री सर सर एक मिनट सर एक मिनट एक एक तरफ इंडस्ट्री एक तरफ एग्रीकल्चर एक तरफ शहर दूसरी तरफ गांव अर्बन वर्सेस रूरल इंडस्ट्री वर्सेस एग्रीकल्चर यू आर क्रिएटिंग अ वेरी फॉल्स एंड डेंजरस डिबेट इन दिस कंट्री इज द चार्ज अगेंस्ट यू यू आर डिवाइडिंग इंडियन this debate this debate will end up dividing indians are you not worried about that uh, manni rajdeep sardesai ji in english please main hindi mein bolunga kyunki logo ko samajhna chahiye bataiye ye desh de desh samanvay ke sath chalta hai theek hai isiliye humne 2013 ka kanoon banaya aam sahmati se banaya ji sarv sammati se banaya kisanon ke sangathan se baat chit karke banaya inhone adhyadesh nikala man marzi se इसकी हमारी नाराजी है One, मैं दूसरी बात कहता हूं मैं सुन लीजिए मेरी बात डोंट इंटरप्ट मी नाउ मैं चाहता हूं अनुरोध करता हूं प्रार्थना करता हूं नितिन गडकरी जी से नो no. कि अगर आप इस देश में किसान का भला चाहते हैं तो ये किसान और उद्योग की आम सहमति से हो सकता है ये देश में लड़ाई आप करवा रहे हैं गांव की और शहर की आप करा रहे हैं किसान और उद्योग की आप सहमति से इस देश को चलना चाहिए और समन्वय तब होगा कब होगा जबकि आप ये अधिग्रहण अधिनियम जो है व्हेन दिस लैंड एक्विजिशन एक्ट व्हेन दिस लैंड एक्विजिशन एक्ट इज नॉट पास थ्रू ऑर्डिनेंसेज but is debated in the parliament is given to the select committee Rajin. where the kisan but you passed the, the act in what? 2013 uh, that you yes. passed an act in 2013 exactly this is what we want and now you want to debate again no no because they brought the ordinance they they removed Rajin. it they okay. Rajin. Rajin. let me finish that you are being unfair yes. you are being unfair to me finish finish let me be let me be clear yes <laughs> we we brought this act with unanimous yes. with unanimity <coughs> they brought amendments by divisiveness this is what our complaint so is so you are saying they brought it by through an ordinance which is your complaint my my this my request through you yes to the honorable prime minister and the nda government is that instead of pushing this ordinance instead of pushing this ordinance 
instead of Mr. Nitin Gadkar, who is not in charge of the of the ministry yes. which is handling the rural uh, the, the land the, in the uh, acquisition act. Rajdeep ji, sir, sir, the, the, the grandson of Sir Chotu Ram is the minister in charge. He is in the background. Nitin Gadkari ji is not holding that portfolio. He is coming to the debate. What is the accusation but, you are making against Gadkari ji? Yes. Are you saying Gadkari ji is batting for corporate India? I, no, no. You let, please let, speak clear. Let me let me let, uh, let me complete. <laughs> Let me complete, Rajdeep. Huh. Are, please don't interrupt. I would, would have completed this if you had not yes. Go ahead. interrupted. What I am trying, trying to say is that this bill has become contentious because of the <coughs> attitude of Mr. Narendra Modi and the BGP government. Okay, I get if your point. Given, I need to give the final word. One second. If this ordinance had not been brought and given to the select committee, where the farmers could have also participated in the debate. Kisano ki baat bhi agar sunli hoti, to ye jhagda peda nahi hota, jo aap ne kar diya. Okay. Nitin ji, I want to know in conclusion, is this your nuclear moment, where Narendra Modi ji has decided, for the growth of India, for development of India, as Narendra Modi sees it, this act is necessary. Will you even have a joint session of parliament? Will you have, answer my direct question, will you even have a joint session of parliament if necessary? First of all, this act is very much debated in the parliament by the Congress party. Mm -hmm. There was a lot of discussion. Which you supported in 2013. Times, many, of, many of them giving good suggestion. Yes. Some of the suggestions from the opposition party we already accepted. Yes. And I am telling you, when I was a rural minister, yes. at that time, I organized a meeting of all state governments in Vigyan Bhavan. Mm -hmm. We discussed with them. I have got the minutes of that meeting. Uh -huh. And in that meeting, majority of the UPA rule state, majority of the left party state, they demanded to the government to change in this act, giving some uh, relaxation in some provision. On that basis, we make that ordinance. Now the problem is that, I am telling you the very yes. simple thing. First of all, I am assuring Digvijay Singh Ji that we are not going to use this act in the interest of the corporate, in the interest of the rich people, in the interest of the industry. Again, still, we are ready to discussion. But the problem is two months, the leader was not Do there. you want a joint still, session? we are ready to discuss with them. Do you want a joint session no, no, or select not? Select committee. Select committee. You want select committee? Are you ready for joint session? First of no, all, are committee. you ready to talk to farmers? Yes. Are, are you ready to talk to farmers? Kisano se aap baat karoge ya nahi? Sir. Ye bataiye, kisano se baat karoge ya nahi? Baat karo. We have... हमने किसानों से बात की, की है किसान संगठनों से चर्चा की यस हो गई बात अभी भी चर्चा करने के लिए तैयार है इनसे भी चर्चा करने के लिए तैयार है किसानों से भी चर्चा करने के लिए तैयार है हमारा ओपन okay. है कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं ओके ऑन दैट नोट ओके ओके सो द गवर्नमेंट हैज गिवन अ कमिटमेंट द गवर्नमेंट हैज गिवन अ कमिटमेंट दैट इट इज रेडी फॉर अ वाइडर डिस्कशन इंक्लूडिंग विद फार्मर्स ऑन दिस प्रोग्राम the land acquisition bill through the select committee is it through the select committee is it going to be a watershed or a waterloo for this government through the select committee Nitin Gaskari, Nitin 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 thank you very much for joining us give them a big hand ladies and gentlemen thank, thank you. you very much